Hi, today we're going to compare two pairs of ordered points, ordered pairs, to see if they create lines that are parallel, perpendicular, or neither. So to be parallel, they have to have the same slope. So if my original line has a slope of 2, then if the new line has a slope of 2, they're parallel. If my original line has a slope of 2, then, and the new line has a slope of negative 1 half, that's its negative reciprocal, then they would be perpendicular. And then if we get any other answer besides those, it would be neither. So now let's do our own pairs. We're going to take AB, find the slope of that line, and then CD, find the slope of that line, and compare and see if these are the same, perpendicular, or neither. So let's start off with the slope formula. And the slope formula is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So let's plug in, and I have x1, y1, x2, y2. So I take the difference of my y's on top, 2 minus a negative 1 over 1 minus a negative 2, which leaves me with a positive 3 over 3, which is equal to 1. So double negatives we add, and that's why it's 3 over 3. Let's take the same equation with our two other points. So now we're going to label these x1, y1, x2, y2, and do the same thing. So I'm going to take my, the difference of my y's, so 4 minus 2 over 3 minus 1, and I'm going to get a positive 2 over a positive 2, which reduces down to 1. So now let's compare the slopes of our lines. The slope of AB is equal to positive 1. The slope of CD is also positive 1. So they have the same slope. So they are parallel. So, since they have the same slope, we can say that the two lines are parallel. And here's a quick little overview. If they have the same slope, they're parallel. If they have negative reciprocal slopes, they're perpendicular. And if it's neither one of these, then we say the lines just intersect, and they're neither parallel nor perpendicular. So we found that both of these had a slope of positive 1, therefore the lines are parallel. In order for these two lines to be perpendicular, I'll just show you an example. If the slope of AB is 1, if I make that into a fraction, it would be 1 over 1, and its reciprocal, negative reciprocal, would be 1 over 1, but then I would also make it negative, so that would be negative 1. So the slope of a line that's perpendicular to 1 is negative 1. But we can see AB and CD are both positive 1, therefore those two lines are parallel. Hope this video was helpful.